must be the phone crew. We, we spoke on the phone. Come in, come in, come in. I'm Sylvia, um, Lorenzo's girlfriend. This is um, actually his apartment. He's just getting ready. And as you can see, this is also actually the, the CLU headquarters. <laughs> SCLU, or the DCLU, is the Zombie Civil Liberties Union. I founded it after Lorenzo's incident. It's only been 10 days, but we have quite a following. How many? Well, in person, three. But our online following is much greater. We had quite a few signups, but after it became apparent that his condition wasn't contagious, many left. <laughs> Lorenzo, babe, are you ready? You're not even dressed yet? We have to go in a couple minutes for the rally, remember? <sighs> ba babe, the film crew. Is, is that today? Yeah. Ten days ago, I jumped into the Tiber River and came out like this. Sylvia and I have been together for almost two years now. I really love her, but the whole zombie thing has been really rough on her. When she asked me about creating ZCLU, she was so excited. I, I couldn't say no. But now she wants to have rallies and there are always strangers in my home and... <laughs> no offense, sorry. I ju it's just that I kind of wish things could go back to normal. So what's this rally about? Parliament doesn't want to give you the right to vote. But I never voted before I was a zombie, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, it does too matter, and don't say the Z word, that's offensive. The Z... the zombie? How is that offensive? I mean, it's even in your organization title. Okay, you and I both know that I didn't really think it through when I named it. And, ow. Besides, the minute you say zombie, it gives people the wrong impression. <laughs> Really? For what? You know exactly what. Lorenzo does not consume human or human byproducts. That's all based on Hollywood nonsense. He's perfectly happy eating other cranial organs from other mammals such as pigs or cows. Right? Right. Now we're walking towards a rally because the government doesn't want to give Lorenzo the right to vote. They say that since he's scientifically dead, he shouldn't be able to. But I say that as long as he can reach the polls, he should be allowed to. I'm Dr. Silvestro, the lead medic on Lorenzo's case. Lorenzo's medical condition is quite the anomaly. No record shows anything else like it. As far as we can tell, the only thing out of place is his lack of a heartbeat and regular blood flow. But it appears that as long as Lorenzo does not stay inactive for over two hours, his body movement and gravity seem to create a sustainable amount of flow. My, my, I started the SCC FHNMZ after this monster came about. His existence is a clear sign that the environment has begun its revenge on humanity. We're here to protest this rally. Letting his abomination of a species vote? Can they even think? We should be more focused on limiting the number of his kind. Soon we'll be overrun by them. They're coming, man, they're coming. Bug zombies. Your chat is too long. Shut up. Your members don't even know it! Oh, your mom oh, doesn't know, know it! it. Watch oh, 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 
as with any important movement, you're always going to have some trolls. <clears throat> is it not obvious that Lorenzo is the first to be blessed with life after death in its most literal form? He is our God and Messiah. We will follow in his ways, each partaking in the plunge, in hopes of losing this cursed heartbeat of ours. Lorenzo is our God, because his wisdom led him to be the first of a new age. I dropped my favorite hat into the river and jumped in to get it back. It was pretty gross. Thanks for coming. Have we met before today? We've yet to be formally introduced. I'm Julia. I'm a reporter for What's Trending.com. I was one of the first journalists on the scene when they announced your miracle. So, I'm guessing you're not here to hold signs. <laughs> no. I don't blame you. It doesn't seem like that's what you're here to do either. No, I, I am. It's just my girlfriend said her movement needed a leader, and it had to be me. Honestly, I couldn't care less. Look, I'm probably not the best qualified to be giving you advice, but I think you should just do what you want. But the movement? There are like nine people here total. And if being a journalist has taught me anything, it's that even these guys won't care about this in a couple of months. Sure, it would boost morale if you were here, but it would boost morale even more if you cared. My lord, thy lady requires thy attendance. Please, don't. Well, it was nice to meet you. Thanks for the advice. <sighs> Humans, with and without heartbeat, today is the big day. Today is the day that we show the world that it cannot step over our friend and loved one. The government says that the right to vote ends at death. But what is death? It can not only be determined by the heartbeat, but also by the soul. And anybody who has met this brave, brave man knows that he has no lack of that. Yeah, I love you! And now, Please welcome the face of, and for our cause, Lorenzo. Woo! Yeah! Oh, uh, hi. So, I'm Lorenzo. Take me! Uh, no, thank you. And... Ten days ago, I jumped into the Tiber to get a hat. This hat. And since then, everyone's wanted me to be something. A leader, a scapegoat, a god. But I'm not. I'm not eating with loose things. I'm sorry. And I love you. But this is your movement, not mine. I'll always be yours, man without a heart. But I can't do this anymore. Today is the big day. We're going to go protest Rome's annual dog competition. Those dogs dressed up for show in this heat? I don't think so. Right? Let's go. Hey, babe. Hey! No more hot dogs. Oh, oh no, not yet. We're still on for Julius tonight? Yeah, charades, fondue. I, I wouldn't miss it. I should be done with this at around 6. Ah, that sounds good. Okay. Have fun, guys. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> 